Hey gang, Dusty here. I love using these Lego heads for both sorting and storage, and maybe you do too, but I find there's one big problem when using them. What is it, and how do we fix it? Stay tuned, it's coming right up. I'm going to modify this Lego head a bit. I find the holes to be too big. They're obviously made for 2x2 two two bricks. You see they fit through the top tray. But not the bottom one. But a lot of other parts do fit through the bottom tray. So you end up with them right down the bottom. So we are going to make this thing better. If you don't know which is which, they've got numbers inside them. This is number one, so it actually goes in first. Alright, so we take that one. Chuck it onto a bit of cardboard and trace around it. To make a filter template. That's what we'll call it, a plate filter. Doing it on cardboard to make sure it's right before cutting out the proper plate filter. Trace all the way around making sure the pencil goes into all the indentations. We can use the magic of editing to get it cut out. Boom, that's done. Put it down in there. Grab a marker. Now you trace around the template. And again with the magic of editing and an adult's help. We have the filter cut out. Fits in quite nice. I'm going to mark out the center of each hole. This is probably a good time to mention all my Patreon supporters. I'm using an old cutting board. Well, let's call it an unneeded cutting board. We had heaps and I needed to make content. Now all the centers are marked out, I'm going to hit it with my drill. I made a mess of it and here's what it looks like. Got a lot of leftover material around the holes. I'm going to hit that with a pretty rough sandpaper. I managed to get a lot of the dagger bits off and it's looking pretty sweet now. There it is. I'll give her a test run, eh? I've got here some Legos that fell through both trays right to the bottom. When I didn't have the plate filter in. Lots of 2x2s, rounds, jumpers, modified 1x2s, wedge plates. So let's pour them in and see what falls to the bottom with a little shake. Stop stuff there. Okay, a real good shake. That should be enough. Nah, a little bit more. Okay, now we can put that over there. Give it a bit more of a shake. You thought we were done, didn't ya? Now if we have a look at the parts that have fallen through the plate filter. What do we have here then? We'll have a look at the bigger pieces we got here. 1x3s and 1x4s. The rest are 1x2s and 1x1s. Some of the modified 1x2s fell through but that can't be helped. Overall I think it's pretty good. Maybe you've got a better way of doing it. Please let me know in the comments.
build your awesome. Cheers, gang. Don't forget to subscribe to Mayo Hosco.